Rock and roll music exploded into the mainstream in the 1950s and had a profound influence on American lifestyle, fashion, attitudes, and language. Some people believe it even had a positive influence on the civil rights movement. Well, in today's video, I want to show you that classic 1950s progression that helped shape music forever. My name is Rob Reed. I'm a public school music teacher. Let's check it out. The 50s progression, also known as the heart and soul chords, the stand by me changes, the doo-wop progression, and the ice cream changes. Where does that one come from? It's instantly recognizable and can be heard in classic hits from the 50s right up to today. It's very similar to the 12 bar blues progression. We learned in my last video that the 12 bar blues is made up of the one, the four, and the five chord. Well, the 50s progression is also made up of the one, the four, and the five chord, but it has an extra chord thrown in, the minor six chord. That goes in between the one and the four chord. So it would be one, minor six, four, five. If you're playing this progression in the key of C, we know that C is the one chord, F is the four chord, G is the five chord, and A minor is the minor six chord. So the progression would be C, A minor, F, G. If you could play the 12 bar blues progression and this 50s progression, I think you could play every song from the 1950s. Let me know if you agree or disagree down in the chat. Let's check out some songs with this classic progression. First one from 1954, Earth Angel by the Penguins. Now the song's in the key of A flat, but we're gonna put a capo on the first fret and use G shapes and play it in the key of G, just to make it easier on us. So the one chord would be G, the minor six would be E minor, the four would be C, and the five chord would be D. So it sound like this. Earth angel, earth angel, Will you be my, my darling dear? Love you all the time. I'm just a fool, a fool in love with you. So another one with this 50s chord progression is the Monster Mash by Billy Pickett, released in 1962. Now this one is actually in the key of G, so there's no capo involved. It's just G. And E minor, C, and D again. So it goes something like this. He did the mash, he did the monster mash, the monster mash. It was a graveyard smash, he did the mash. It caught on in a flash, he did the mash, he did the monster mash. Why? Another song with this progression is Crocodile Rock by Elton John, released in 1972. Now, this song is also in the key of G. But we're going to play it in the key of C this time to show you different chords. So if it was in the key of C, the 1 would be the C chord. The minor 6 would be the A minor chord. The 4 would be the F chord. And the 5 would be the G chord. And it would sound like this. La, 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 la. La, 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 la. La, 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 la. And we'll rock it up. La, Another great song that uses this classic 50s chord progression is Every Breath You Take by The Police, released in 1983. I want to show you a really nice take on it with a fingerstyle arrangement. Now this song is actually in the key of A flat again, so we're going to put a capo on the first fret and play the G shapes. So G would be the one again, as you know. E minor is the six, minor six. C would be the four, and D would be the five. So check out this really cool arrangement. So this next song brings us right up to the 2010s. It's called We Are Young, Fun, featuring Janelle Monet. Now this song is actually in the key of F, but we're gonna put a capo on the fifth fret and use C shapes again. So the one would be C, the minor six would be A minor, the four would be F, and the five would be G. So it goes like this. Tonight, we are young. So let's set the world on fire We can burn brighter than the sun Tonight 
All right, so that classic 50s chord progression that made hits in the 50s continues to make hits today. If you want to learn more about the 12-bar blues progression, check out this video. See you in the next one.